when you go into entrepreneurship, having your eyes open, because sometimes what you think you're going to do is really just a journey or a pathway to the thing that you're going to do. And in that context, it's the classic example of trying to solve a problem for ourselves or a challenge for ourselves. And then looking at it and saying, we just built a better mousetrap and that's the business we want to be in. And so that's really how it evolved. It wasn't very, we didn't have a particular perspective when we all came together, we were running a, a performance marketing company and we had clients that needed this type of service to be able to take their products from their product catalogs, their websites and effectively syndicate these products to the whole world, the advertising world, Google and Bing and Yahoo. And after time, Facebook, all of these emerging as in channels, marketplaces like Amazon and eBay. But even at that time, really the whole social, the, the monetization or the commercialization of the social channels like Facebook and Instagram and now TikTok, really all of them have emerged now as commerce channels. They places where people advertise to sell stuff and where people can go and buy stuff. And in order to achieve that, you need exceptionally powerful technology because the way that those product catalogs are housed, that the underlying source of truth is not the way that the products need to be syndicated at the places where people are going to shop. Yeah. And so we had some very, very challenging situations with one client that had over 1 billion products that we needed to ingest on a consistent basis and then pare it down to 25 million at any given time in real time and send it through to Google and other channels. And there was nothing that could solve for this. And so Robert and Brian said, look, we can build this for ourselves, for our client. And then we built it and we looked at it and we said, this is better than anything in the world, literally. The UI wasn't particularly pretty, and, and it, but the underlying functionality of it yeah. was game-changing. 